Hi Libra, welcome back. This is your one car read Libra general message for um, January 2024. I don't know why I'm thinking about July. Here we have the Page of Pentacles, Virgo, Capricorn, Taurus. It's also going to be a child, a younger child, teenager. We have strength here. Leo's energy. Hmm. There's a card that I'm looking at right now. Let me see. Ooh, King of Pentacles. I will put him out because he was flipped over in the deck. Okay, and I did see it, so I managed to catch that before we did the read. Okay, so right off the bat, Libra, I do see um, someone that could have possibly been married. This is husband energy here with the King of Pentacles. Okay, they could have been married to a Capricorn or some Earth energy. Virgo, Capricorn, Taurus, you also could have been married to a Leo's energy or a strong Gemini energy. We also have um, more Earth. You guys could have had a child together as well, all right? Um, for the general message, I just see your money growing, your, you prospering, having success, having abundance um, that you deserve. I do feel that you work very hard for it. Um, maybe someone's husband or boyfriend is getting like a better job or something and that's how they're going to support you and your child or something like that. I do see that. Um, with the strength card here, someone's viewing you in January is very strong, um, will-powered, confident. I just get that um, your money is strong or you're going to have more growth in your money or your money is going to have more strength or something. Or I don't understand what I'm picking up. Oh, um, so what is this? What is this? Okay, justice. A lot. Okay, so right off the bat, here we go. Libra, your justice in January 2024 is money. And this is Libra. This is the energy of Libra. This is your card. This is your energy. You guys are getting money. You could get money from an um, older male. That's, that's what I'm saying. This King of Pentacles energy here. You could get money from this person. This person could give you money. And then also um, you and your child. They're going to give you and your child money. Your justice, Libra, is money. I don't know if this person owes you or something like that. Or they're just going to come in and give you guys some money. But that, I don't just see him giving you money. I see him giving his child money as well. You and the child money. Yeah, um, your husband or your boyfriend is very abundant. I don't know if they got a different job or something like that. But they're making a lot of money. They keep pointing me to all these grapes here on his... Um, There's tons of grapes on him. He, I don't know. Someone's got a lot of money, guys. All right, Libra, your boyfriend, your husband, whoever this is, someone's got a lot of money. Maybe someone, like I said, got a better job or something like that. They're making money and they're giving it. I just keep feeling that they're giving it to you. They're going to give you some money and the child, their children, okay, that they have by you some money. That's what I keep getting. Um... That's probably all that's coming through right now, too, because I'm not feeling nothing else. Situational love oracle deck. And also, Libra, your justice is money. I forgot to add that in. I did tell it, tell you guys that earlier. But someone's justice is money. Okay, so I don't know if someone took money from you or either um, you, you loaned out money to someone. Whatever is going on, you know, if someone wronged you financially, that is going to be clearing up in January. What does this person want to say to Libra? January 2024. I don't know why I cannot talk today. What is, wow. What does this person want to say to Libra? Yeah, healthy choices. Something about the color green as well. I don't know if you guys are eating a lot of salads in January or something like that. I don't know why I'm picking that up. It says self-love and self-care, being happier, love in life. Hmm. At the bottom of the deck, we have ascending. It says learning and experience, I mean, expansion, transcending, preparation, and union, and new phase. So you guys are coming into union with someone. This person is very well off, very abundant. 
Libra. They're very abundant. They have money and they're very generous is what I'm picking up. They want to share it with you and your your children that you guys have together. It says partying. It says time with friends, having fun, happy, happily single, living in the moment. Okay, we have separation. It says sadness and bitterness, missing you, thinking about you, and uncertain future. And with these spikes, I'm also keep picking up someone was hurt in the past. It says cut down. It says cutting out, separation, stop the pattern, silent treatment. That's what it's talking about. Stop the separation. This King of Pentacles is ready to talk to you, okay? And they're ready to come back in. They're ready to be solid. They're ready to be stable. I do see it's a child's father here that's ready to come back in and be with you. So these two cards, they are to they rep, kind of represent the same thing here. It says cutting out separation. And this card says separation. And this is talking about cut down. It says cutting out separation. Stop the pattern silent treatment. They don't want to be quiet no more. They're missing you. It says, thinking about you, uncertain of the future. Cupid's arrow. Have faith, love is coming. Surprise, invitation struck by love. This person is ready to come in. And they are well off. They are prosperous. They're successful. They're abundant. Um, they got money is what I keep feeling from this person. They got money. They're um, pretty abundant here. Okay. And like I said, they're coming in and they're ready to they're ready to do this now with you. So if it is a past person, they've changed their their whole perspective on life. Okay, they also have done better financially as well, and they're coming in. I also see too, they might have to have the strength to talk to you. Maybe they hurt you in the past, but they're still coming. See, that's what I'm saying. The main energy at the bottom of the deck, this other deck was ascending. Learning and expansion, transcending, preparing for union, new phase. Yeah, you guys are definitely coming back together. If you are separated, if this is resonating, um, you're coming back together, Libra. But you're coming back together with some earth energy, Virgo, Capricorn, Taurus. And this person, how you're going to know about them is they're very abundant. They have money. Um, they're also showing me the car or truck that they're driving. So it, maybe their money is, um, maybe they got a new truck or a car or something. This per they're showing a truck. Um, this person got a new truck. Okay. Take care, Libra.